What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? This is the student master teacher, Mr. I Stay Woke, Chris Monroe, and I'm right back at you with another Turo video. Today's video is brought to you by WokeRealEstate.com. You're gonna learn more about real estate and getting to the bag. WokeRealEstate.com has everything you need. So for today, um, I'm at this tow facility. Um, my car, my blue, beautiful Mustang, I just bought maybe, I don't know, two, three months ago. Haven't had it that long. Was in an accident. In an accident. The guest sent me a message um, yesterday afternoon, about five o'clock or so, telling me that um, he was sideswiped. He claims he was sideswiped, so it may be a side swiping it may not be we're going to find out because many times they say things that aren't necessarily true so um i was getting notifications within my gps tracking device you know through this trip that uh hard acceleration hard braking so it sends a little notification if somebody's taking off real fast or they stopping real hard so i have these gps tracking units on all of my vehicles uh which i can actually use the kill switch if I want to kill the starter like turn the starter off or disable the starter and I also have it to where you can actually lock and unlock the doors so this one was uh, on that system all of my vehicles are on there they all have two trackers that's um, you know the safest way for me just in case somebody decides to not want to bring their vehicle back so this particular vehicle been out for about almost two weeks or so and uh, he's been extending, extending, extending. Like he'll rent it for four days, rent, extend it for three more days, extend it for four more days, things like that. So he's had this car uh, pretty much the whole month of June, I wanna say, or July, I guess, because this is August, the pretty much the whole month of July. So he's probably been telling people it's his car. He's probably been saying, hey, it's really my car, guys, you like it? Showing it off and spending that money. So it's all been good. He spent over 1,200 bucks uh, coming to my pocket in regards to this particular rental. Um, renting it from a range from anywhere from $92 today a day up to uh, I think the highest maybe 125 so somewhere in that range is what they've been basically doing it so he sent me a message yesterday through the app on Turo telling me that he was sideswiped been in an accident so I'm like contact Turo that's what I told him contact Turo he's like oh okay I tried to call him but nobody answered so I went on in um, and looked at my GPS tracker and I noticed that it said unauthorized movement which means it was on the back of one of these flatbeds it was on the back of one of these tow trucks so if the vehicle is moving and it's not really driving it shows up as unauthorized movement so the vehicle was not supposed to be moving but it was so basically it ended up being taken to this facility here uh, where I'm basically gonna have to have Turo's claims come pick it up and take it to a body shop of either my choice or either to their facility to see if it'll be totaled if it won't be totaled they'll um you know i'll have to you know i'll find somebody to fix the vehicle um if it is totaled they'll give a claim number and all that and tell me what it's worth supposedly from there so fingers crossed that this vehicle is not totaled because um i just bought it like three months ago for 15 grand so it's a 2010 convertible blue beautiful mustang you might see it on my instagram at chris monroe stl if you want to see what it looks like before and i'll try to put some pictures in here as well and some video so to see what it looked like before but we're about to go check out what it looks like after i want you to tell me in the comments though do you think this vehicle is total or do you think it could be repaired or what do you think should happen uh when i did look also within the turo app to see what the guest Mr. Donovan, what he actually had as far as insurance, his maximum out-of-pocket cost was $500. So he did opt into some type of insurance from the Turo side. And that's one thing people got to remember when you're dealing with Turo.com. Uh, your insurance as a host and that renter's insurance as a guest are separate insurances have nothing to do with each other whatsoever. They're totally separate. And as well, we can go third party. My personal insurance has nothing to do with it. I'm not bringing any of this claim to my personal insurance. It's going on their Liberty Mutual or their Turo insurance, and they're going to go through what happens with that or their protection plan that it is. Now, there was no injuries from what I understand. He told me there were no injuries, but the vehicle was towed here to this uh, facility here on Big Ben. So we're about to check it out. 
and uh, see what happens, all right? Let's see. Here we go. 2010 Mustang destroyed. He said he was sideswiped, but it don't look like it to me. So it looked like it's at least one side is messed up, but he definitely hit something. Somebody was side swipe. Huh? What a joke. Side swipe by your bad driver. So what do you think? Do so you think this vehicle is totaled or do you think this can be repaired? Look like they got to do a new bumper, a new front fender, a new hood. Maybe could pop that out, I don't know. Maybe could save that. But uh, all of that underneath there, the suspension and all that's all destroyed. All bad. Mm -hmm. That's what we got. Busted up. I ain't even had this vehicle three months yet, I don't think. Toro. You say you like it, get on there and get you a vehicle like this. I'll let you know how the claim process goes in a minute. And there's another car coming in. All right, now that we've seen what the vehicle looks like, it ain't looking nice, it's looking bad, it's looking sad. So I'm gonna take what I've took about I don't know, 25 pictures of all different angles, upside down, up underneath, close-ups, far away, all of that. And I'm going to upload that to the app on Turo, and they're going to, you know, do their magic. Now, this thing happened to happen on a Friday night yesterday. Today's Saturday morning. So we don't think anything's going to happen to this probably till Monday or Tuesday, to be honest. We're going to do everything on our side. But with it being at this facility, I can't do anything. I'm not going to release it because I'm not going to pay to get the vehicle out. Turo's going to handle that. They're going to pay whatever the tow was, the hookup, the storage, the overnight, whatever the fees are, all that goes on Turo. So like I said before, the guest had uh, some type of coverage, up, only up to $500 maximum out of pocket is all he can pay. Everything else falls on Turo. Uh, for me, I'm on a 60-40 plan, so full coverage. I have zero deductible on this particular deal. No deductible, so I'm on a 60-40 protection plan when it comes to Turo. So we're going to go through this, document this whole journey. Make sure if this video helped you out in any kind of a way, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, post them in the comments. Matter of fact, give this video a thumbs up, give it a like, give it a share, and leave a comment anyway. Just let me know what you think about this. Would you be upset if somebody destroyed your car you only have for about three months? Would you be mad? Would you be glad? This is part of the ups and downs of the things that you want to make sure you're prepared for defensively when it comes to putting your vehicle up on Turo or hire a car or any of these other platforms because these people just can't drive. And this guy's a college student from what I understand because when I was looking on my tracker, I kept seeing him go back and forth to Columbia, Missouri at least twice within this uh, couple of week excursion he's been on. So hopefully you got some information you like. If you need to get real questions and want to get a real consultation and book a call with me, you can do that. Go to chrismonroestl.com. Real easy. chrismonroestl.com. You can go right on there and book an hour, 30 minutes, whatever. And we can get on the phone and chop it up and see how we can help you protect yourself against things like this from happening. You really can't stop it from happening, but you do need to be protected by having the proper setup, the proper systems, the proper trackers, all of that information, chrismonroestl.com. So with all that being said, do what you do, be who you be, and I'll see you before you see me. In the Middle East. <laughs> Some of the clock getting that brain food. 
find more leads than you can even process. That's multiple listing service. That's the MLS for you real estate agents. Absentee owner information. Find the cash buyers and flippers in any market nationwide. Pull a pre-foreclosure list. And don't forget, you got to find those comps. Get nationwide access with multiple filters powered by PropStream at WokeSource.com. Get your seven-day free trial today. WokeSource.com. That's WokeSource.com. You may have heard the saying, the fortunes are in the follow-up. Now there's a brand new system that is great to help you code call, text message, drop voicemails, and so much more all automated. You don't have to remember anything. Just set it and forget it. All you have to do is speak to people. Check it out. WokeReply.com. It's a multi-touch marketing campaign where you can schedule to send text, voicemail, email, and even live calls all on autopilot. Check it out today. WokeReply.com. That's WokeReply.com.